couple of rolls of bank line. Yeah, for the duct tape, drill the tape that is. All right, let's do this. Here, you can see I got a spider web together up here like that. It's a netting. I'm gonna do that over here. I've got it Oops, opened up. Watch your head. <laughs> Conk. Anyways. Remember, if you're alone in the woods and you hit your head like that, don't let yourself fall asleep because you might not wake up. That's war, war, a hack. No, I'm okay. okay. I'm just gonna let this camera roll in real time like I did last time. But now it's this time. Now. Yeah. Comfy cozy it is on the inside, huh? Got the citronella candle going. Oh, watch your head. <clears throat> That's better. Alright, no more playing around. It's time to get busy. Getting hot. Humid's more like it. There you go. Now I'm gonna select the bean. That one over there. See what I just did right there? This is real time, so see I took this beam right here, brought it across there, see? And then I tucked it into this one. Right there, if you want to tie those together, tie that together, bring it down over there, actually. Maybe I tuck it down over there too. So I think I'll cut it right there and use that as a second beam. Alright. formation see that's for strength and stability the X in the center of the cross what Jesus died for us hallelujah anyways thank you Lord okay bring it back over here 
go ahead and loop it in the middle here, just to strengthen that seat. Ooh, see what I did there? Can you see what I'm doing? And it's up there if you can see it. I'm gonna bring it back over here where you can see it. Maybe this way. So this beam. Same thing. Twist, wrap for the harness. Back under it over. This way. Same thing. Gotta keep it as tight as possible. I'm gonna spray it up to the top. See? The corner of the corner. Wrapping it. After a while, you get to where you don't really even have to look at what you're doing because you know the motions of the twist and wrap. Pull it tight, of course. Yeah. I'm going to wire connects over here. It's black to the beginning up there already, so I'm connecting this to there. Just crossing it, of course, if you can see. All the way up the bus. Up the bus. Up the bus. Christmas Halloween, y'all. And Halloween is a pagan tradition, by the way. So if you're a Christian, just by the way, I should mention, you shouldn't celebrate Halloween. It's in the scriptures, if you study the word, and want to go to heaven, then you're going to observe that. And not traditions of man, pagan traditions, that is, like Halloween. But anyways, here I go, continuing down the middle, wet the back down. See how that begins the netting, and then it connected to this. And to that, just wrapping it around each one. See how easy that is? Yeah. There you go. So, I heard it was going to rain, but I prayed for a beautiful day. God is wonderful. He blessed us. It's a beautiful day. Hallelujah. It's a beautiful day. In the apocalypse. A beautiful day in the apocalypse. Apocalypse. Hallelujah. Okay, um, I just realized I wasn't supposed to be working on netting right now. I'll get back to that. I need to finish securing this beam. So I got it right there in that corner, up to here, and then I got distracted. <laughs> Carried away as I tend to do with the netting because it's so much fun, man. You should try it. There it is, secured in the corner with some netting crisscrossing, as you see, if you can see. There's the netting. There you go. Now you can see it. That's the beginning of the netting, anyways. Got it to here. Oh, oh. There's now it continues over that way. Oh, watch your head. These beams obviously want to be tied together. Okay, I want to take a moment and thank the new subscribers. And if you haven't already, give this a thumbs up. Okay, feel free to leave a comment. Somewhere down there. And as always, be careful, stay safe, and God bless you. You, yes you. Thank you. Keep this as a pop-up hole. I like it. Now I understand that some have scoffed at these videos. Because after all, this is season five. I think it's taken over a year working on this project. Compared to other YouTubers who can complete shelter in one day such as Corporal's Corner. I understand I'm enjoying the experience. Taking my time with this one because this is actually the prototype, which I don't understand. Actually made more process, uh, progress on the replica, I guess you could call it, the actual height spot. Undisclosed, of course. 
come on, now you think I was gonna reveal where I'm gonna actually be? Never do that, that's foolish. Don't take your cameras with you, it's a tracking device. In fact, leave your wallet, everything you possibly can behind. This camouflage is only for the eyes. There's infrared, they can see your body heat. They got drones and planes flying around, man. This hat's not gonna hide you from that. It may help a little bit, but... Just giving it a real, y'all. Make sure your actual hide spot is at least a mile away from the prototype. Don't tell anybody where it is, obviously. Or invite somebody to help you unless you absolutely can trust them. I've considered inviting some help out here, obviously, but then I'm like, mmm, no. Although this is just a prototype, so I could. I mean, I revealed it to y'all, so why not? Somebody, in fact, suggested it may have been mockingly, but they said, hey, why don't you hire some help, man? Get that thing done. Anyways, back to work. Watching your head, of course. Back to these meetings. Oh wait, I'm supposed to be tying those beams together. Not bad. That's better. And of course I had to spend some more webbing. Make sure your hide spot's near a water source, but not too close. And of course make sure you have ways to purify the water if it's not already purified. Nothing obvious. Great minds think alike, so think great. Boom. Okay.